Uh, I'm not suggesting that anybody not buy Joe's macro package because I'm sure it's far better than what I'm going to show. What I've done here is just drawn up one room, put it on the first floor, one room, put it on the second floor, and I've just got a polyline out here that I'm using for demonstration. So you could, you could of course, um, make living area polyline or make room polyline that would create a polyline around your structure. I'm just, I'm just doing this just so I can show this polyline out here and not have it intermingled with the building. You could also take this and just manually draw it wherever you wanted it. So I've got two things here. I've got this text box and uh, it's just got this macro in it. So dollar B, dollar just says make a global uh, variable. And the variable name doesn't matter. So I've got, uh, I'm, uh, I'm assigning the area to dollar B. And over here on this polyline, I've done the same thing in the label. I've used a different variable. I've used Y here. So dollar Y, that creates a global variable Y. And a global variable just says this variable is going to remain after this macro executes. So it just assigns the area to the uh, global variable Y. And that's what you see here. This one gets rounded. This one doesn't. You could round this too. And down here on the first floor, I've done the same thing. This this uh, pie line is just a different size, just to just to show how it works. Same exact thing. This one uses dollar A, and this one uses dollar X. So this is just another text box. Uh, it's got a macro in here that says dollar a plus dollar b and that gives you the the addition of both of those this is another text box it's a little bit fancier first floor dollar x second floor dollar y total uh, dollar x plus dollar y and i've rounded it to two decimal places So like I said, you could do the same thing you could manually move this stuff around and then you can see here these t these numbers changed. This is one of those things I couldn't believe that that wasn't included in home designer or chief architect this just seems such a basic basic thing um, that you'd be able to do this so anyway like i said take a look at what joe has michael might have something as well but this is just something to experiment with